Hey everyone, it's JJ for Filmora here to empower your inner video creator and we are back with another episode of You Ask We Answer, our series where we answer the questions that you guys leave us in the comments section of our videos. So I have a whole bunch of questions that I found from our last You Ask We Answer and they are now in our big red bag. Big red bag. And I'm gonna answer them at random. So here we go. Let's get started. Okay. So, so this question is from Swift Fury. Hey JJ, great video. Could I ask what your recommendations for reducing gimbal motor noise are for Filmora? I do a lot of GoPro POV mountain biking videos and I can't seem to figure out which frequency gimbal motor noise is. Thanks. So if you have footage that has excessive background noise, Filmora 9 has some audio features that can help with that. So let me go ahead and show you. So what you can do is go to the audio options and click remove background noise. You can choose between three settings, weak, mid, and strong. One of these options may not be enough, which is why I recommend also using the equalizer settings. So depending on your footage, you may need to play around with the audio options available until you find the right setting for your audio. Okay, all right, so let's get into our next question. So this is from Green Bandit, hello. How do you add flicker light effect? Awesome, so let's go into Filmora and let me show you how you can do a flicker effect. With your footage in the timeline, go into the media library and get the black sample color. Add this to your timeline above your footage. Now trim or cut the sample black to the length you want your flicker to be. I'm gonna cut it to about two seconds and remove the excess. Next, all you need to do is copy and paste the black along the timeline where you want to add the flicker. Play it back and voila, flicker effect. You can get creative as well. You can also do flicker effects with other video clips or colors. Extend the length of the flicker and see what you get. So this question is from <laughs> MD Mabunzan Man Rubel. Very cool name. Hey, can you make a video on how to remove noise in video? Not audio noise, but video noise in Filmora 9. So for those of you who don't know, video noise, which is not audio noise, is the grain in your footage, which can sometimes happen when you have low light in your shot. So to fix that, let me show you what you can do in Filmora 9. So at this time, Filmora 9 does not have a quick fix for video noise, but depending on the amount of noise you have in your footage, we recommend experimenting with the different filters available in Filmora 9 and the color controls like shadow and contrast. Play around and see what can be done and voila, you can be able to fix some of your noise, but maybe not all. So just give it a try. Okay, next question. This question comes from Camgang Bryce. Thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> Please, can you share how to split screen in Filmora 9? In the previous version, it is possible in the clip. Thanks in advance. So the split screen feature was not included in early versions of Filmora 9, but it is gonna be included in future updates. So what you can do until then is you can actually manually create your own split screen. So let me show you how you can do that in Filmora 9. So with your video layered on your timeline, click the effects tab on the top of the editing menu. Under the utility category, you can find the crop feature. Just drag the crop feature on the layer to add the feature to the video. Then double click the layer and under video effects, there will be options to crop the video. You can also move the position of the video by clicking under transform and adjusting the X and Y position, scale and even rotate your video. All right, so next question comes from Girma Yidbarek. Hello. Where is the power tool in Filmora 9? So yes, the power tool is in Filmora 9. It just might be kind of hiding somewhere. So let me show you how you can find it in Filmora 9. In Filmora 9, you can find the power tool feature under effects and in the utility category. There you will find the crop tools, face off, mask, mosaic, and tilt shift. So there you go. That's where you can find the power tools in Filmora 9. So this question is from Gabe, not Dave. Does Filmora have a disintegration effect for an Infinity War parody of sorts? All right, so I'm assuming what Gabe, not Dave, is referring to is the Avengers Infinity War um, disintegration effect, which was in the last movie. So Filmora 9 unfortunately can't get that industry level effect. However, our good friend Daniel Batal has created a tutorial on how to get this effect using some tips and tricks in Filmora 9 and also using our martial arts packs, which you can get for free. So if you wanna check out that video and how he gets that done, you can check it out in the link in the description box below. Check out Daniel's video. It's really, really cool and super creative and it really is impressive on what you can definitely do in Filmora 9 to get those industry level effects, kind of like a hack. So check it out. 
And if you guys have any other creative videos on how to create things using Filmora 9, let us know, share it, so we can share it with our community members because you know what? Filmora 9 is just a software. All the imagination comes from you guys. So we wanna see how creative you can be. Share the links in the comment section below, okay? And that's all for the questions for the day. They're all gone, oh my goodness. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. And if you guys have any more questions or have any tips and tricks that you guys wanna share with us, don't forget to leave them in the comments section below. See you guys next time. Bye.